I'm Lucid Fiasco, and welcome to... The softball is terrible, right? Well, not so fast. The softball is a terrible weapon if you try to use it like an assault rifle or SMG, but it can be both effective and hilariously fun to use if used correctly. So what does it mean to use the softball correctly? Well, this is a weird weapon. The shots slowly loop out and explode after a short timer. If you are going face to face with nearly any other gun in the game, you will probably lose. Luckily, the softball can do things that all of those other guns can't, and you have to take advantage of those aspects. To succeed, you'll need to be pretty good with the movement system, as you will be shooting while wall running and jumping, doing your best to be difficult to track. Your enemies will need pinpoint precision to hit you, but you only need to see them long enough to pop off a couple softballs in their direction. Don't stick around to see if you killed them, just shoot and retreat. If you give them a chance to kill you, they will. Here are the three basic tips to follow when using the softball. Number one, use it on maps that make sense. The softball excels when you are able to A, use lots of wall running to get above and around your enemies to shoot down on them, and B, shoot into congested areas such as doorways or choke points where they can't easily escape your explosive damage. Maps like this would include Dry Dock, Complex, Backwater Canal, and a few others if you feel comfortable. Maps that would not be a good idea to play on would be big open maps like Forward Base Kodai or Homestead. If you use the softball on these maps, it will just be frustrating and really won't be any fun. Number 2. Use Phase Shift. The mantra of softball is attack and retreat. Wall run above your enemies, fire quick softball rounds, and retreat before they can react. The retreat part of this equation becomes much easier when they literally can't see you due to phase shift. Also, phase shift can protect you during the crazy long reload time of the softball. Pro tip, putting tack to kill on your softball will allow you to phase shift even more often if you're getting kills. This can be pretty deadly and very frustrating to play against. Number 3. Use a pistol as your secondary weapon. As I mentioned, the softball will almost always lose a one-on-one -on -one fair fight. So if you find yourself in a hallway, out of ammo, or stuck in close quarters with an enemy, you need a safety net. Having a pistol will save you in those tricky situations, and also save you a lot of frustration. There really isn't much need for an anti-titan secondary when using the softball because it's pretty good against titans. Essentially, use it like you would use a mag launcher. Try to stay mobile and reveal yourself as little as possible. Be a pest, doing as much damage as possible and drawing the attention of the enemy titan so your teammates can go in for the kill. So that in essence is how I use the softball. No, it's not the best gun in the game, but it's really really fun to use and can actually be quite effective if you use it in the right way. That will conclude this episode of Tips and Tricks. If you learned something, feel free to subscribe or check out the rest of my channel for more Titanfall content. Thanks for watching, pilots.